Oh, hey, Steve. Hello. How are you? Okay. Oh, that's good. What's that's up? Good. Well, um, I'm reading about how to make stuff out of fused glass from the microwave. I'm not sure if I might blow up or something. Yeah, we should probably use the microwave for little nicer things like cooking. Like cooking? Like cooking. Are you hungry, Steve? I'm always hungry. Well, well, what would you like? Uh, I like nuts. I know you like nuts, but what would you like? I mean, do you want walnuts or pecans or cashews or peanuts or... I like peanuts. You like peanuts? Peanuts, yeah. You, you know that peanuts aren't actually nuts. They're actually legumes. Legumes? Legumes. Legumes. Legumes, yes. Legumes, huh? Yep. So do you like them even though they're not nuts? Uh... I think I'll make an exception. Okay, so we're gonna make something with peanuts. Hey, actually, you know what? It's Thursday. Hey, you yeah. know what I do on Thursday? You, what do we do on Thursdays? Uh, uh, three ingredient recipes. <gasps> That's right. Yeah. Do you want to make one with me? Yeah. Is it with peanuts? The legumes? Yeah, that sounds great. Okay. So, you like peanut butter? Of course. Do you like cookies? Of course I like cookies. So peanut I bet- Peanut cookies are even good, too. What? Peanut butter cookies are good, too. Peanut butter cookies are really good, and in fact, yeah. that's what we're going to make today. Yay! So, these are peanut butter cookies. They don't have any flour. Um, they no are- No flour? No flour. It's just three ingredients, and here are the three ingredients right now. Wow. Peanut butter! Your first ingredient is peanut butter. Um, you're going to want to use uh, peanut butter that's not all natural. So um, I know that some people like to just use all natural peanut butter, which is certainly much more healthy for you. But for this recipe, it really works if you have sort of a processed kind of peanut butter, like Jif or Skippy or any of those uh, brands. Does it matter if it's crunchy or uh, or creamy? Or? N no, you can use creamy or crunchy. Um, I think creamy works a little bit better, but either way, it's going to work just fine, and you'll use one cup of this. One cup. Our next ingredient is one cup of white granulated sugar. That's a lot of sugar. It really is. It's the same amount as peanut butter, but it really holds it all together, and of course it makes it really, really sweet. Sweet. And then finally, to bind it all together, one egg. Just one egg? Just one egg. Not one cup of eggs? Nope, nope. You use uh, one cup of peanut butter. One cup of peanut butter. One cup of sugar. One cup of sugar. And one egg. And not one cup of eggs. And not one cup of eggs, just one egg. One egg. One egg. One. 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 Is there another one here? In a large mixing bowl, you're going to mix your one cup sugar and your one cup peanut butter and one egg Beat this with an electric mixer until it's all smooth and creamy and well blended together. After this is all mixed together, you're going to take about teaspoon sized pieces of the mixture and just roll it in your hands until you have a smooth little ball. And then you're going to transfer those balls onto a cookie sheet. You don't have to grease the cookie sheet because there is a lot of oil in the peanut butter so all you got to do is just put this directly onto the cookie sheet once you have all your dough balls arranged on your cookie sheet then you're going to take a fork and what you're going to do is you will cross over both sides on each cookie and this is going to give it a pattern and it'll also flatten out the cookies so that they bake more evenly once you have all the cookies crossed over with your fork marks, you can either just pop them into the oven or you can put just a little tiny bit of sugar on top for a little bit of extra crunch and a little bit of extra sweetness. These are now ready to go into a 350 degree oven for about 10 minutes. After 10 minutes, the cookies can come out of the oven. These cookies are kind of hard to tell if they're done or not because they don't really change color much and they don't spread out very much. But just trust in the fact that if you have it in a 350 degree Fahrenheit oven for about 10 minutes, maybe a little bit more, maybe a little bit less, it is all going to cook together and it will all become a cookie. Uh, these are very soft cookies, they don't get very crunchy, so just uh, let them do their thing, let them cool down, and then you'll be ready to eat. So, we're all done, Steve. What do you think? Oh, that's a lot of cookies over there. That is. It's, it's is well, it one cup of cookies? It, <laughs> it's way more than a cup of cookies. This okay. is, um, I got uh, 15 cookies out of this. And uh, it's actually, it may, you can make a full dozen or you can make a few more. I made them a little bit small, but uh, they came out really well. Do you want to try one? I think so. 
What do you think? Mm, very, very nutty. Very nutty. Yep. Even though they're legumes. They are legumes. Legumes. So these come out really uh, soft. They do have a little bit of crunch, but not too much. Um, they do hold together really well for something without any flour in it, and they are tested by Steve. He really does like them. So, Steve, what can people do if they like this video? Well, they could share it on with their friends. They can share it with their friends. And, and they can comment on the wall. And comment below, you know, on the wall or just below here, yep. Um, Give it a thumbs up. A thumbs up. You don't have any thumbs. I don't have any thumbs. Nope. And you can also subscribe if you want more of these three ingredient recipes. We are here every Thursday. This is the first time Steve has joined me. Hello. Hello. Steve has, uh, he, Steve's actually a stage actor. He played uh, the squirrel in My Place Stuck. If you haven't seen that, you should check out uh, Stuck. I will actually link it somewhere up here. I'm great in the chimney. He is. He's great in the chimney. Spoiler. Spoiler. Um, so we're also here on Tuesdays to talk about men's long hair, which Steve seems very, very enamored of. And Can I have some too? Um, maybe we'll get a wig like we did with Rupert. Okay. And then on uh, weekends, George is here to talk about being good to yourself. I'm good to myself with your hair. And can you hear, if you can hear, Gracie is enjoying herself because she's eating a plastic bag right now. Hey. Thanks so much for joining us. Uh, Steve and I are going to enjoy our peanut butter cookies, and we hope you have a good week. Bye-bye. Are you, are you doing my hair? Are you are you doing my hair, Steve? Uh, I'm trying. <laughs> it doesn't do it. You can't do anything with my it's hair. It's a little long. <laughs> we'll work on it later. Okay.